All right, so today we're going to take a look at the Great Hall in part of Monmouth University, Long Branch. Uh, filming a, quite a few movies. The only, only one I can think of off the top of my head is Annie. Um, I don't even know what year, but you can see a pretty old looking building. I can't tell. That is a gargoyle or just a statue on the top. But we're gonna investigate. Uh, first look at this great hall has got to offer. Um, I will leave the year that it was supposedly built in the description. Um, I think it was about somewhere in the late 1800s. Very nice copper stuff, but the first thing I did notice was, you know, here we are at ground level, um, and <clears throat> I'm not sure what this <laughs> is, guys. Uh, is this a second level bedroom? I mean, obviously this is all um, facaded up. Who knows what's behind here? Very crappily, I might add. You can see the uh, copper wearing down. Yeah, so this is a very interesting um, <laughs> it's, it's pretty strange to me. Obviously, I know this isn't old world. It's just like a cheap facade. Some of this stuff is pretty cool. Just a cat right up there. Cherubinuski, Egyptian, Interesting fireplace. We're about twenty foot ceilings in here. And here's the um grand interior. 
stained glass on the new thing. Pretty marvelous up there, guys. Hard to really tell. Beautiful ceiling. Marble up there. Pretty serious stuff. First time going in this building. Ooh, gotta check this fireplace out. So intricate. Who puts these symbols up there? A naked centaurian woman? Who decided that? It's pretty strange. Yeah. There's the great hall. I mean, this is all wood carved, wood ceiling. I've never seen anything like it. Now we'll uh, have a look in the back. School's are in session right now. Every other time I've been here, um, the building is pretty much like closed. Yeah, here's the back. Um, I just wanted to show this back area. Kind of, kind of an <coughs> intricate um, double layer thing going on. There it is. The whole building is, is one layer down there. Um, then not so much. It's the only building that I see on this campus like that. So if this is an old mud flooded structure that was refacaded, which is I'm 90% sure it is. There's no other reason to build like that. It's just like it's kind of weird that there are no other buildings that I can tell. This is a, this is has to be an old church because it has those that's a roof system. Um, so you know, I mean, roof this has been here for a long time. You can tell there's a lot of carvings up there. I mean, the vases, of course. And there's a vase, as you can see it on the actual um, building. Let's go check that one out, actually. That's pretty wild. I knew there was ones on there, but that one looked like a live still. Huh. Oh, there's, there's tons up on that building, huh? Yes, there's like a fake one on the left. And what I would consider like a more real one. Um, so are these just symbolize what those were? Maybe that one is the missing one. Um, I don't know what they are. <laughs> they, they look like urns. Or maybe they were uh, Lytle jars. You know, that'd be my first guess. Seems like they kind of. Um, <clears throat> look like a Lytle jar. Store energy. Yeah, different fountains. They probably look beautiful when you're running. Yeah, um, there's the Great Hall. We'll go around the side and I'll uh, end it there. See if we can get a better look at the uh, Lytle jars. There's a hall in here now. Will they find out more? Yeah, 
Obviously, we can't tell what this building is like. There's not many old pictures from what I can tell. Um, it's a very, uh, what's that stuff? It's stucco. So it's moldy and it just looks bad. It's cracked. Um, oh, oh, ladies and gentlemen. We gotta get this down there. I'm afraid I'm not gonna go back. Guys, I just figured out the secret. Look, all these things I didn't even notice they were covered. I gotta get down here. Greg, how am I gonna get down there? That looks pretty sick. From what we can tell from up here, until I get down there, it obviously goes down further. Um, I can't tell. Let's see if we can see in from another one. See, they're all closed up. And I would have never noticed had that one not been open. That that is just an opening. It's just, just like a false floor. And really, there's a window right below that window. So, I'm glad I came here and filmed. I honestly wasn't that psyched on showing you guys that building until I discovered this. I would like to get down there. There are some maintenance guys right there. Um, so, I'm not going to hop down here because, honestly, I don't know if I can get back up. But no doubt I will get down there somehow, if not today. Wow, super cool. Oh wait, here we go. Let's see if we can see a little further down over here. Yeah, so I got a... They aren't, they weren't gargoyles as far as I could tell. I believe they're just cherubim statues. Yes, ooh, ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner. All right, guys, let's see, see how big this building really is. So, what we thought was, you know, that is really, guys, I don't think you can tell, but that is two floors down. And there is a door down there, guys. Oh, moly. Look at that. I'd love to get in there. I'm going to go talk to the maintenance guys. See what they say. That is the coolest thing ever. Guys, see how deep that is? Whoa. Holy moly, this building is big. I'll see what they say.